What's up everybody, this is Alex Yu and you're watching another episode of You Can Eat and we're at, uh, what's this place called? Hongmi Korean Restaurant and uh, we are here for we're here for the Kamjutan we'll get a large, right? yeah, a large yeah, we'll get a oh, this menu is so nice yeah We just ordered our kamchatan and what else did we order? An order of kalbi? What Galbe. is that? Galbe? Galbe. Galbe. What is that? Short rib. Uh, short rib. Maui ribs. ribs. <laughs> We're getting Maui ribs. It's a Korean restaurant. Awesome. The special is that the kamchatan, which is pork bone stew, pork bone hot pot, is half price. We got four of us here, so hopefully uh, we'll finish it all. You're saying hi to me. <laughs> So we decided we're gonna get a little bit of drinks. What are we getting? Yeah, I think we should go with the uh, the yogurt soju. Yogurt flavored soju. It's kind of a sweet, and it's basically the um, Asian yogurt drink mixed with the soju. You know what I love about Korean restaurants is that they serve barley tea. What we're drinking right now, I I thought it was corn tea, but it's not. It's barley. And what I also like is they always play K-pop, and they have music videos in the background. One of the, some of the latest K-pop stuff it creates like a bit of a nice. Uh, upbeat atmosphere whenever you go to these places. Yeah. It's like a guy from the tournament. It's like nothing. It's like a rice powder. Okay, yeah, that looks like something like that's like jelly, jelly, doughy. Yeah. We got kimchi. Oh, oh, you Is that seaweed? Yes. Seaweed and then just like bean sprouts. And we all get yep. rice in a metal oh, okay. bowl and it keeps it hot. I think. Yeah. Okay. Pretty cool. Yeah. I keep calling him Malcolm. I don't know. Oh my god, there is our kamjatang. This is a pork bone hot pot. We just put all the put all these into the soup so that the soup can absorb the this flavor of the the the, the, the Spices and the onions. This is the first time I've seen it come with bean sprouts. Oh wow, look at that. That looks so good. Mm, it's my favorite. That's your favorite? Mm -hmm. And you're just cutting it into smaller pieces for us. Get that service. Yeah. I love short ribs. One of my favorite foods is short ribs. What's awesome about these uh, Korean restaurants is that we always get these side dishes, and what's even more awesome is that they are refillable. When we run out, damn, we just get some more. Oh yeah, look at that. We got our soju. Yogurt flavored soju. We're gonna have some of this. That is really good. I've never had the seaweed before. The seaweed side dish, never had it before. It is really good. Man, this right here, what I'm having, is called mook. <laughs> three second okay. rule, three second rule. Okay. So the reason why we're here is because I was following uh, uh, Mini604 on Twitter, and she tweeted that Kamjatang, the pork bone hot pot from Hongmi, is 50% off for the month of May. Then I confirmed with her just to make sure that that, that deal is legit, and here we are. So, following tweets got me here. Here is my soju, yo yogurt soju. Gonna try some of that out. Haven't had this in a long time. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, how do we, what do we say? What do we say? Gambe. 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 Okay. Gambe. Gambe. <laughs> mm, I like that. That is good. That is really good. What'd you think of it? The yogurt. What? What'd you think? It's good? I never had yogurt. That was really good. Oh boy. Look at this piece of short rib. I love it when it comes with that layer of fat. Oh boy. Now we're ready to serve. That looks good. Let me tell you, the best foods comes with bones. Chicken wings, ribs, pork bone. All that. Fried chicken. <laughs> See this metal uh, bowl? This is our bone bucket. See what I'm saying? We just put all our bones in there. Because pork bone obviously comes with a lot of bones. So, a lot of bones are gonna go in there. I just ate that short rib. Man, the beef is so tender. It's so, um, 
It's just not chewy. It's just, just grilled to perfection. The Kam Tang we ordered is kind of mild, so we asked for a little bit more spice. It's like a paste. Normally, when I order this at like other places, they put like mustard seed on the top. They don't do that over here. That's still good because um, it's got a mild flavor to it, and you can get more spice on the side if you want it. It's like totally optional. So it really depends on the level of heat that you want for your kam chitang. I'm just digging in right now, enjoying every bite. The meat just glides off the bones. It's just like having a, a, a roast lamb at a Greek restaurant. The meat just like comes right off it with little effort. This is piece number two for me, and this one is full of meat. Like I said before, uh, $19 for the large size. Amazing value. I hope I can get this vlog to you guys in time. And if you're watching it in December, just come for the food anyways. Come for uh, come for the soju, come for the kam chitang. And it, what's great is that booze goes good with spicy food. So have this a little bit spicy. And just order some yogurt soju. And you're gonna have a good time. We are done. We just pounded that kam chitang. And all our, um, our drinks are done. Our side orders are done, side dishes, our, our short ribs. Man, it was like we haven't eaten in like years. Look at the bones. I mean, someone just boned that thing, man. Damn. Just devoured everything. Just devoured everything. And just nothing but bean sprouts and all like the, the healthy stuff in there, but we ain't gonna touch that. We just want the meat because we have a bunch of meat eaters. Overall, I'm very happy with uh, this meal. Great deal, great value. This concludes our episode of You Can Eat. Stay tuned for my next episode where we try out chicken wings from Cambodia. This is Alex Yu, and thanks for watching You Can Eat. Peace.